Okay, so we're on a roof in Dunkirk, Maryland. Our customer is having a problem with the attic fan leaking. And we've discovered the problem. We actually had, uh, I guess one of those high winds came through and blew this shingle up. It also delaminated the shingle. Which means that this two-part landmark shingle by certainty came apart. So that had to be a pretty fierce wind. So we're going to seal that and take care of that. While we're up here, we noticed another problem. And it's a common recurring problem that we see with these plastic pipe collars. If you take a look right here, look at this pipe collar. What happens when the sun hits these is they start to bend out of shape. You can see right there, that just creates a nice path for the water to get in. And once the sun bends them out of shape like that, they just stay like that. So what we do, instead of replacing them, this one's still in pretty good shape except for that problem there. We put sealing along in there, nail it back down, and seal this shingle down. There's a problem over here. And this one was just installed improperly. We see this, you know, we see this all the time. So we're going to actually take a couple shingles, remove the shingle here and here, cut new ones out, and replace that. So stay tuned and we'll come back and take a look at the repairs after we're done. Okay, as promised, we've put uh, GeoCell tripolymer sealant under the pipe collar, nailed it down, and then sealed the top of the nails with the GeoCell. Uh, we used clear in this case so you could see what was happening. Okay, so we've repaired the leak above the attic fan. We've also sealed the bolts with GeoCell tripolymer sealant. That's a good practice. We've also performed service on eight different pipe collars. Three of those were installed incorrectly. And this roof is fairly new. These two were the major problem. We also put in a few shingles here, a couple new shingles. So here's a little tip. Take care of your pipe collars. Have them checked out every couple years. You're going to avoid a lot of damage that way. And we thank you for watching our roofing channel, mdservices.com. This is Bill Thomas, and we'll see you next time.